Here are all the required parts laid out. Let's start with the edge and captain boards. Attach the four M3x10x6 standoffs with four M3x8 crosshead screws. Next, assemble the touchscreen. Undo the MIPI DSI and TP latches. Then insert the flexible FPC cable. Observe the orientation closely. Fold the cable over itself, then slot it into the acrylic cover. Press down firmly on the adhesive edges. Ensure the cable is vertically aligned. Next, we will assemble the buttons that go on the top cover. You will need a pair of pliers or a vice grip and an M2 or M3 crosshead screwdriver. Use the pliers to grip the M2 lock nut and your thumb to secure the top cover. With your free hand, begin screwing. This step does require some practice. Check the correct depth using a golden M2 standoff as your measure. This is how the button is supposed to work. Continue with the remaining 7 buttons. Check to ensure that they are all the same height. Attach the remaining 7 golden M2 standoffs. Travel should be smooth and precise. Insert the FPC cable into the top cover. Carefully observe the cable orientation. Then attach the FPC cable into the captain. Let's also attach the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth antennas. Wi-Fi on the left, Bluetooth on the right. Secure the battery to the captain. And an NVMe SSD if required. Insert the captain into the bottom cover. Start by inserting the front side, then the back side. Slot the antennas into the left pocket and close the top cover. Then hold the touch screen with your hand. Secure the captain to the bottom cover using the M3 standoffs. Use a pair of pliers to tighten them. It is time to attach the touchscreen panel. Grab an M3x12 crosshead screw, then insert the M3 star toothed washer. Insert it from the outside direction. On the opposite side, insert the M3 nylon washer, then lock nut, and screw them lightly in place. Do the same for the hinge on the left side. Tighten the hinges with your pliers and crosshead screwdriver. Adjust the tightness to your liking.
connect the lithium polymer battery to the captain. Boot up will occur automatically. 